what's up everybody hope you guys are all doing well i am getting out of work and what a long day it has been man i am tired uh but that's not what the video is about i wanted to go a little bit heavy on this topic i was watching a video last night and it was a little bit disturbing to me now i know this is something that happens all over the globe but <laughs> I think it was it was Quezon. Am I saying that correctly? Quezon, Quezon City, Quezon City. Yeah. Where these foreigners are going there, basically, in my opinion, and taking advantage of these young girls. Now, if I was a dad, I would not allow my daughter to walk out the door dressed the way these girls are dressed. First of all, okay, they are dressed down. You know what I mean? And, uh, man, I, I got to tell you, man, it's, it's, I was, this video, there, there's a lot of them, okay? Don't, I mean, there's a lot of the same video where it's showing that sort of thing. Um, but I just find it really disturbing on how men leave their country to go over there and have their way with these young girls okay and of course these young girls are, are going to do whatever it takes I mean that's that could possibly be stability for them you know what I mean or it could possibly lead into having a relationship you know of some sort who knows but it was just disturbing and here was the thing that really got me, and that was when you see a man that is looks like he's almost in his 80s, and he's walking hand in hand with a 20-some-year-old girl. That's a little disturbing to see. I'm sorry, but, you know, they say love is love. You know, love, you can't put an age on love. But really, guys, is that really love? I mean... Is this man taking advantage of that situation? Heck yeah, he is. He's taking advantage of that, just like the younger guys are. Because here in the States, I know for a fact it's not like that. A lot of guys leave the States to go over there so they can take advantage of however many as they want. That is, that is a fact, okay? Because it is that easy. It's that easy. But what another thing that was disturbing to me is how you see security and possibly even the police that are standing around with these girls and, and they know what's going on, but nothing's done about it. I don't understand if if it's something that's illegal, then why isn't anything done about it? Okay, I, I just I don't get that. I don't understand that. Um, I, for one, you know, have traveled the Philippines many times, and I have never gone into an area that, that it was like that. Um, but I don't know. I mean, what's, what's your take on that sort of thing? I mean, what's your opinion on that? I just think that guys are doing that because they know that that's easy bait. It's easy bait. I mean, I don't know. Uh, you you see to where you have foreigners that go over there and, and they impregnate a young girl and then they bolt, they take off. And now this girl is left with having a child that could possibly be half Filipino, half American, or half whatever, Australian, half whatever. Um, and they don't have a way of taking care of the child because this foreigner took off on them. I mean, seriously, guys. I mean, here in the States, you can't do that sort of thing, okay? I mean, yeah, an older person can have a relationship with a younger person or younger girl. But here, it's clearly looked at as, you know, that's just wrong that is wrong because you know you could be this girl's grandfather 
you know what I mean? And um, th that girl could be your granddaughter, basically. So um, it just doesn't get looked upon very well uh, with that sort of age difference. Um, you know, do you think I'm being too harsh on that matter? I, I don't know. I just found it rather disturbing to see how all these foreigners are all, you know, all within the same location and you know they're they're trying to make their way with these young girls and like i said you know it's 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 uh it's a money making opportunity for these girls um you know what kind of risks are you taking by possibly you know having having your way with somebody when you really don't even know anything about that person um, you're taking a very high risk of contracting some sort of whatever you know I think y'all know what I'm talking about but um I just found it disturbing guys I don't know the times that I've been over there I have seen old men old men walking with these young girls like hand in hand and it's disturbing to me. I'm sorry, but it just is. Uh, it, I don't know. It just it doesn't seem like it's it's a right kind of match. Um, it could very well be that it's just this older man has this girl as just for a companion for companionship and nothing more. I mean, they could be just looking for that, or it could be the other way around. Um, but. What is your take on that sort of thing? How do you feel about that? You know, I mean, do you think it's, it, it doesn't really matter? Or, you know, um, most of you that have lived, you live in the Philippines or you've been to the Philippines, you know what I'm talking about. Because I know you've seen it. So, you know, what, what, like, I'm asking you, when you're there and you see that sort of thing, what kind of an impression does it leave you? I mean, how do you feel about seeing that sort of thing? Um, you know, there's times where, you know, I, I don't even know, guys. It's not the first time that I've watched those videos, but it's just disturbing to me. I don't know. It's just don't, it don't seem right at all. Um, men over here, in my opinion, you cannot just, get yourself a girlfriend it just doesn't work that way um, or you can't just find somebody to mate with okay but when you travel over there you know that it's easy bait and that is the only reason why these guys are there and some are older some are young and uh, I don't know man that's pretty messed up I think that's pretty messed up I don't know I don't know that's just that's just not that's for me personally that's not the kind of person that I am so I'm gonna think differently about it but um you know I'm 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 basically looking at the this the like the, the girl you know I'm looking on at her and, and thinking you know why why are you doing this to yourself you know what I mean um, or why are you taking such a a huge risk of possibly causing more of a problem in your life you know what I mean so I don't know guys that's 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 all I got on this I was just you know I got in my car and I was coming home and I just started thinking about that video that I was watching and it was just kind of disturbing to me what's your take on that sort of thing leave me a comment let me know what you what you think uh, don't forget to hit the bell so you know when the next video is coming and uh, Keep it real and love one another and I'm gonna have another video coming out guys Where I'm gonna be talking to you guys a little bit about something pretty awesome that I have um, Let me just say it's it, it's a It's starting to, to be a change for myself and I'm going to share that with you guys in the next video. So keep it real, guys. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.